Hello everyone. Welcome to MS Apti webcast. In this video, we are going to see the steps on how to set up automatic device cleanup rule in Intune. We often see many stale devices in Intune which are not cleaned up and because of this, we face challenges to keep the Intune environment and reports updated. With Intune device cleanup rule, we can configure the automatic cleanup rule which will clean up the inactive, stale or unresponsive devices which haven't checked in recently. The rule allows us to choose the number of days between 30 to 270 days to automatically remove inactive or stale devices from Intune records. This way, we can keep the Intune environment and reports updated with the active devices details. First, we need to access and log in to the Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center. We can access Microsoft Endpoint Manager using the URL https colon double slash endpoint.microsoft.com. Click on Devices, scroll down to Other and select device cleanup rules. By default, the device cleanup rule is disabled. We will have to click on yes to enable it. Click on yes. Once we click on yes, we will then have the option of specifying the time frame since the device last checked in. Intune deletes the devices based on the custom number of days we specify. If we enter 30 days, the devices which are in an inactive state for last 30 days will be deleted from Intune. In many cases, it is recommended to specify 90 days. If some users had gone for a long vacation, but this depends upon the organization. We can have custom days value between 30 to 270s. When you enter 29 or 271, Intune won't allow you to save the settings. Let me specify 29. We can see the message. The value must be at least 30. And if I try to specify 271, again we will see the message. The value must be at most 270. Here, we will specify the value 90. After we click Save, all devices that have been inactive for specified numbers of days will be immediately be deleted from Intune. Intune will continue to delete devices as they exceed the numbers of set days. Reports with data about the deleted devices may take up to 48 hours to refresh in Intune. Click on Save button to apply the device cleanup rule. We will receive a warning pop-up saying that the devices that have been inactive for the specified number of days will be deleted from Intune. Click on Yes to save and apply device cleanup rule. We can see the confirmation message, device cleanup rules saved. Intune provides an option to find out and export the affected devices with the device cleanup rules we just implemented earlier. But I forgot to show you earlier, so again I'm going to click on No. Uh, let me click on Save, click on Yes. And let me again turn on the settings. Let's specify the number of days 90. And here we can see that option. To ensure whether you are deleting the correct devices, click on View Affected Devices link and confirm whether you want to remove those devices. Let me click on View Affected Devices. Here you will get the list of devices that haven't checked in 90 days. In our case, we can see we don't have any devices, but if you have any devices which is inactive from more than 90 days, those will be listed here. Once Intune Admin or Global Admin enable this rule, Intune services will run a background job 
every few hours to remove all applicable devices from engine portal and they won't show up in any engine blade or device list anymore remember this removal applies only to engine portal and devices do not get removed from azure active directory azure ad tenant admin has to perform the device cleanup task in the azure active directory portal to remove the stale records permanently so let me close this uh, click on save to save the changes click on yes and we get the confirmation message device cleanup rules saved so that concludes the video on how to set up automatic device cleanup rule in microsoft intune using microsoft endpoint manager admin center thank you all for watching this video have a nice day